Hello everyone and how lovely to see you all again and welcome to this week's arrangement called Sleepless in Seattle. So cool because these fiery fuego blooms are so incredibly hot that I'll be staggered if you can get to sleep. Ow! And this wonderful oak leaf is a, is a great autumnal foliage and a fun fact about oak leaf, Prince Charles II hid in an oak tree for a whole night to escape the parliamentarians. And now, always remember to look after your flowers. Snip an inch off the end of all your stems, use clean room temperature water and a nice clean vase. So to arrange this golden bunch, we're gonna start with our three lovely fuego blooms arranged evenly around the edge of the vase. And then we're gonna face our slightly shorter rose hips opposite each other. So what we're trying to do is create our structural grid in the middle of the vase for our other flowers to stand up in. And we're then gonna to add to this grid with our alstroemeria facing them opposite each other, creating a square with our rose hips. And what we now have is a lovely shape to our arrangement with our shorter flowers around the edge. And into our stem grid, we're now gonna add our taller lilies, which will stand upright in the middle. And then our wonderful foliage is gonna sit on either side of our lilies and then leave it to bake for a few days and it'll look a little more like this as your lilies and alstroemeria burst open. All I'm gonna do is trim it down for one of our cut down vases. And to do that, all I'm gonna do is take last week's arrangement and lay them out on the table in their unique stems and then cut them in half and follow my arranging instructions from last week. And there we have it, a beautiful cut down arrangement, perfect for the middle of your kitchen table. And when trimming some of the lisianthus, some of the lower lateral stems came off with it. And these are perfect for popping in a bud vase, perhaps along with a little trimming of some of the eryngium and maybe even some of the snowberries as well. <clears throat> Thanks so much for watching. I hope you love getting creative with all your flowers and see you next time.